Hey, hey, Blue Table fans, it's time. Boy, you guys are spoiled. You're going to get all sorts of bat reps this week. Uh-oh, I just said there you get all sorts of bat reps this week. Hey, hey, Blue Table fans, it's time for a 40K bat rep with Ren. Ren! He's uh, been uh, touring with the Almond Brothers, and, uh, but he's back to play some 40K with me. So uh, what are we doing today, Ren? Well, right now I'm setting up the board. Uh, no, we're playing a game of 40k. We're going to play... I'm playing my Blood Angels, as uh, you've seen before, and Sean is going to play his Tyranids. Okay, awesome. Yep, so uh, Blood Angels, Jump Infantry, and lots of them. Lots of them. Probably only two or three or four scoring units in here. Uh, yeah, actually... Well, we'll, we'll see. Okay, fighting a battle. Number one, you choose your armies, and we've chosen 1,500-point armies. Next, you roll up your mission. So here it comes. The mission is number five, the Emperor's Will. Okay, the next stage is to set up the battlefield. And uh, Rin has already done some uh, generic terrain, just kind of relatively uniform across the board. So we are gonna, we're going to stick with that. But we roll up your deployment map, which is a five. And that is Vanguard Strike. So that means it will be split down the middle just like that. And next up, okay, so we roll off for table halves. I got a one, and Ren got a five. So what's going to be, Ren? Five. Good question. Yeah. So it's got to explain. This way, this way, yep, it's going to be right across that. So that corner or this corner. Okay. Okay, step three is setting up the battlefield. So you set up the, your terrain, your fortifications, and your objective markers. Now in this one, your deployment zone is this half, but not within six inches of this uh, middle line here. So there's like a triangle. Now you can't set your, your objective within six inches of the table edge. So there's actually this little interior triangular area where you can set your one three-point objective for Emperor's Will. Now, I set mine up forward rather than back uh, because I'm going to be playing an extremely aggressive game. Uh, my army list is 100 Ormagants, uh, six units. So two of 10 and four of 20. And I've also taken two Tyranid Primes. Uh, one is just a regular Tyranid Warrior that I painted up uh, for Mini Wargaming's uh, Vault channel, and <clears throat> two units of Shrikes with Lash Whip and Bone Sword. Uh, right now, I'm really I'm not playing with my ideal Tyranid list uh, because, uh, as I mentioned, I have accommodated a client of ours who has a Fungus Nid army just like this one. In fact, much larger than this one. And uh, so I still have to work myself up to uh, probably 100 Termagants, uh, I'm going to get three uh, Turvagons, and, um, guy, what else? What else is going in there? Can't remember offhand. Oh, Zoanthropes. Nine Zoanthropes and a Doom of Molentai. All right, we've deployed, and uh, my deployment is pretty simple. I have five units of 20 Ormagants. So there's 20, 40, 60, 80, 100 Ormagants. You've got Tyranid Prime, Tyranid Prime. By the way, look how awesome our Tyranid Prime conversion looks compared to a normal Tyranid Warrior. Come on! That's awesome. i got to make me another one of those. I know Rin agrees. It's true. Rin thinks, Rin thinks I'm right. Uh, got some Shrikes here for Synapse, some Shrikes here for Synapse. So Synapse is extremely strong right here. And uh, that, is, that is basically my strategy uh, I am going to run up and see if I can choke him with bodies. Because, by the way, out of the 1,500 points, 1,000 points is the Ormagons. And That's Rin doesn't really have a lot of shooting or vehicles, or, so he, ha he has to get stuck in with wave after wave after wave of Ormagons. So talk about what you have on the board here. Okay, so I have, actually I have two squads. They're both combat squatted, though. Okay, um, so 5-5, five, 5-5. Five, five, five. Yes, I have four okay. scoring units, um, okay. and I have one death guard unit. It's big death unit. company. Or yes. death company, yes. Okay, so death is company. These, are these normal? 
guys then? Yes, these are just normal guys. That, a sergeant. There's a priest, a librarian. Sanguinary priest and librarian. Mm -hmm. okay. And it's just normal guys. Okay. Melt two, again. Two, oh, two melt guns. Great. Yeah. That'll be fun, this game. Um, and then just uh, another normal squad. One guy's got a hand flamer. Then another normal squad with flamer and Astro. Okay. That's pretty All right. simple. So you go first, uh, unless I steal the initiative right now. hi -ya! A three. Nothing. Well, I, I wasn't nearly my, uh, enthusiastic and confident enough. Oh, yeah. Psychic powers, psychic powers, yes. All right, we'll get back to you on that. Blood Angels turn one. Rins jumped his guys forward pretty conservatively, actually. Uh, what he's waiting for is for me to move into his charge distance, uh, which will make all the difference. Uh, but quite frankly, I'm not overly worried about that. I'm just going to run units forward as uh, screening units to hopefully draw out some of those charges and, uh, and then just counter charge with uh, whatever's left. So uh, as you may have noticed, I have a lot of gaunts on the board, 100 to be precise. All right, the uh, librarian here cast precognition on himself, allowing him to reroll fails to hit and wounds and armor saves. Yes. So a little bit of good fortune on him. And uh, basically the, uh, uh, what is it, f uh, six squad, wait, one, two, three, four, five squads of guys have, uh, have all moved forward um, just uh, just a little bit, right? Right into striking range. Ren may have even done a little bit of baiting himself here. Uh, we'll see. Maybe. Yep, <laughs> that's the melt again, guys. All right, my uh, turn was pretty straightforward. Uh, I basically just ran the entire army forward. Now, by the way, uh, Warhammer 40K 6th edition is rich and varied in both its rules, tactics, and army selection. Uh, and you're not really seeing that with the 100 Ormagons. I'm just playing this as an example of one thing that you can take. Plus, as I explained, uh, I'm still working to uh, re-flesh out uh, this army. And um, so, yeah, I've got my, uh, my primes. This one up front, I don't know why he is up front, but there he is. This guy I held back a little bit because I have these Melta guns in range. And I don't want him to peel off two of those wounds too easily. Uh, so now it's up to it's up to Rin to like figure this out or, you know, because yes. this is worth three points. This is my warlord. We didn't roll warlord traits. I recommend we just skip that this game. A little too late for that now. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, so really, the most points you can get in this scenario is six. Uh, line breaker, slay the warlord, and uh, what's the last one? Can't uh, remember. First blood. First blood, yeah, that's right. So um, really, yeah, Rin's got to Rin's got to somehow. Uh, this is a tough nut to crack. Yes. Um, he might be he might be best off uh, trying to redeploy his army in one single direction. Uh, the Shrikes really are what he's got to look out for. They are very far-reaching counter attack units. And as you can see, he's trying to get around the edge of this building and maybe uh, pike one of those. Because they represent not only absolute killing power against space marines, because uh, the bone sword is AP2. They have four attacks on the charge. Lash whip reduces opponents to initiative one. So it's really quite an unpleasant experience overall. Wow, there's a lot going on on this battlefield. Uh, but it is, it is relatively open. We haven't classed these as area terrain or anything, so you can just kind of run around... Uh, the edges there, uh, although you would get cover, obviously, for uh, what you see is what you get. Top of the second, Blood Angels. Ren's right. completed his movie. He's done exactly uh, what I was uh, suggesting or thinking, is he just shifted his entire army in a massive redeployment. And, uh, and he, may ver he will probably be able to keep pace with all this and deal with part of my army uh, at a time. So go ahead. All right, um, roll my psychic powers. Precognition? Yeah, precognition. Goes off. Seven. And then my other one, which gives reroll to the <laughs> squad. Okay. Now it goes off there. Okay, great. So uh, this is one unit. This is three units here. Yes. Basically. Yes. Okay. I'm ready. Right, Did any of them run? Or are they just. Yeah, actually, this one redeployed this way, right? Yep. 
And uh, yeah, that was actually a really good move. Mm -hmm. All right, um, let's do. <clears throat> Who's your leader? Oh, your leader um, guy. Who do I gotta kill? He's okay, that guy. Got it. Just, just, just making a note, making a mental note. So, so this probably, is this is who? Yeah, this one, Martis. Okay. I'm probably not gonna shoot because if I did somehow remove it, Sean would just remove the one guy. Right. And frankly, that moves three inches off of my charge. It does. Distance, so it does. Not the smart idea to do. So I'm not yeah, gonna ready. do anything there. I'm gonna shoot with this squad though. Okay, they're shooting into this uh, building. We've taken yep. the lid off of that. Okay, go ahead. All right, so I've got two melted guns. Right, so and that's, uh, where, hold on, where is it? Right There's here, a melted gun? And then pistol guy is right there. Oh, okay, I got it. One, two, three, four. Where's the fifth guy? Is that the fifth guy? Okay, got it. So here's the pistols. Two hits. Okay. It's two cover saves from being in the building. Okay. Two wounds. So one guy dies. And then three pistols. We'll make it this guy. These are bolt pistols, so two hits. Look at the threes. Strength four, toughness three. Two wounds and two cover saves. All right. So one Ormagant is dead. Right, and then these guys. It's like um, floating. My brain's going to fire his oh, pistol. Am I dead? Is this what it feels like? <laughs> okay, what's going uh, on? One pistol and then two bolt guns. Okay, who's shooting again? Oh, this this one. Right, this one isn't shooting. So okay, and they're hit. shooting at the Ormagons. Got it. And then roll that. That's a wound. Okay. And then two pistols. Both hit. And one for threes. So two cover saves. I make both of them. Huzzah. Yeah. All right, and that's my shooting. All right, all I'm ready. One Ormagant down from shooting. <laughs> Top of the second, Blood Angels shooting. Nope, right, Blood Angels yeah, assault phase. Yes. All right, here so we go. Assault phase. All right, I'm notoriously bad for rolling really bad on these. Uh, yeah, I seem to remember that. Now, uh, this will be difficult terrain. Yes, then, yes. Getting a crop, but so, uh, he's only needs like four inches here, yeah, maybe five inches. It's four here. Four inches. Four okay. here to these guys. And like so, hold on. There. Who's charging these guys? So, I'm um, going to have this squad and this squad charge these guys. Oh, okay. The library squad's going to charge first. All right. And then those. Away we go. Wow. Just... Come to Papa, then, Let's I do guess. this one first. Okay, here we go. So, you need, you need three dice and take the lowest two. Three dice and take the lowest two. Okay, got it. Excuse me. Yeah, the lowest. Oh, no! Ah. Awesome. <laughs> All right. That makes uh, Sean happy. And Rin sad. Hold on. What does Rin sad you. look like? That doesn't look very sad. Ah, there it is. That, that, that looks sad. <laughs> That's terrible. I think I, I win worse sportsmanship for this game. Make my opponent look sad. Yeah, you fail the charge. Sad. Make a sad face. All right, here we go. <laughs> so this unit's just like shuffling in here. What's going on? I guess they can. Go ahead. Yeah. Oh no! Three. Three All right, then the last squad. Okay. Well, they obviously make it. Did these guys make it or not make it? That's only like four inches. You got like a five inch charge. Oh, I yeah, think yeah, they yeah. do make yeah. it. Okay. They do make it. It's going to be, you know what? Here's my proposal. Just for sake of friendly game, just move these guys like over here and these guys here, and then I'll just take my casualties off. All right. Right. Well, what, what I was going to do is I was going to hit here, and then mm -hmm. this squad would hit, and they would kind of shift that way a little Okay, bit, well, then do that. Those guys can go oh, forward. but these guys are there now. Yeah, but these well, guys I, are kind of stuck. All right, right, you know, whatever you want to do, whatever's most cinematic for you, I'm ready for that. All right, so. So that's awesome. So this is like, course. this is like World War II room clearing, yeah. you know, building to building urban combat. That's awesome. Makes me happy inside. Right, so you can oh, just you know what? Don't, get, right? yeah, don't, don't, don't measure. Just, okay. just put all your guys up against the edge of the building, and I'll just be inside the building. Okay. I think that'll be the easiest thing. Let's do this, huh? Yeah, I'm ready. Oh, they're moving in. Okay, that's fine. That's what you want to do. I'm ready. All, all right. right. So uh, we end up with four Ormagants not in the combat, and we have uh, 15 Ormagants in the combat. Um, so, uh, my initiative is five. What do you got? Um, well, since Fury's Charge doesn't give me a plus one anymore, just four. Okay. 
Yeah, initiative five. Fantastic. Blah, blah, blah. blah nah, 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 nah. So all I got to do is live here. And yeah, that, and then initiative. all these guys are just going to swing around and just envelop, the, just in a giant, grotesque mess. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, uh, so here we go. So here's this unit, right? Mm -hmm. And then these five assault marines. Let's turn this guy around. His name is Wrong Way Jones. He's <laughs> like, Wrong Way, you're attacking the lamppost. Why would you do that? Okay, so uh, I've got uh, only four Ormagants on these guys with two attacks each. So here they come, two, four, six, eight. And I'm looking for uh, fours with re-rolling ones for scything talents. Every little bit counts, definitely. Oh, look at that, that was nice. Six hits, and I have poison, so I'm wounding on four ups. And that is three wounding hits. Yep, All that's right. these Ormagants against those, the librarians right now. They, they love it. So now I have two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven Ormagons. All right, so uh, eleven Ormagons. I'm going to do two volleys of, um, of eleven. So looking for fours, re-rolling ones. Uh, so that's one, two, whoops, two, three, four, five hits. And second volley. Uh, six, seven, eight hits. That is really below average. All right, so hopefully I can pick it up in the wounds roll. I need to get six wounds here. Oh, no! Two wounding hits. That's it. Wah, wah. Here's my two saves. All right, here we go. Uh, Whoops. I'll reroll that three. Yeah, try it and... Oh, look at that! Two no, no wounds. Pain. So on the, on the net... On the net, okay. nothing. On the net, I killed the requisite number of Marines. So uh, not a problem. But now, now the inevitable counter-strike. But it doesn't matter because they will be fearless, and I doubt he's going to be able to kill all 19 guys. So here's where I uh, sit back, relax, and enjoy Rin rolling okay. dice right, and so killing my guys. First. All right, I'm ready. So it's two from the guy with the mouth gun because he has less. Okay, and so the assault squad. Okay. So it's just the attacks from those guys. He's looking for threes. Only one miss. That's seven hits. Very and respectable. I need threes. And he needs threes. So I, I need twos because uh, I have one extra strength from charging. Oh, okay. Strength five. So, so uh, that is uh, five wounding hits. I'm looking for sixes. Here they come. Nothing. Five guys die. So just to make life simple, I'm going to take them off the back. That's not how you do it. But at this point, uh, I think it'll be six of one, half a dozen of the other. So, oh, and I didn't take off five guys. There you go. Now you're making some progress. So the librarian is, and his unit, that's going to be a problem. So there's the librarian. That's now, the because these are the guys that get the re-rolls to hit, the librarian gets to re-roll to wound. And uh, it is just not, absolutely not a pretty sight. I'll do now, my uh, power sword um, attacks first. <clears throat> but again, I doubt he's going to kill all those guys. We shall see. And uh, it is, it's going to be all over with but the crying once, uh, once, I get, once I pile in here and uh, the Shrikes get to uh, get a piece right. of the action. I've got a lot of power weapons in that unit. I've got three, <clears throat> actually. Okay, so I'm ready. Here's... Hold on, Whoops. do I have three? No, one's a power fist. Sorry, okay. sorry. You had a few runners there. So uh, typically not bad etiquette to pick up your runners. Okay, looking for threes. Ooh, that's a lot of misses. Now I get but to reroll. But he gets to reroll because of precognition, the, the psychic power. And uh, that turns into seven hits. All right. Uh, what do you need to wound? Um, I need twos. I oh, to wow. the wound from the librarian. That's right. Okay, so that converts it. So uh, how many guys die? So and how many six saves? Six power weapons. Okay, so six. Wow, you and he might actually clean these guys up now that I'm seeing it. I'm going to go ahead and just put a dice here, and then okay, remove the my casualties at the end. One, two, three. So three normal guys. I might add in sixth edition, Tyranid's got a huge boost. Because you don't have, because of Fearless, it used to be if you lost the combat by five, oh, yeah, you had to take ones. five armor saves. And that, wow, that's a lot I of hits. Okay, here it comes. All right. 
Uh, that's uh, six saves. So here they come, looking for sixes. Oh, there's two, so four. So that's ten. Anything else? All right, and then I got the power fist. Oh, nice. Oh, look at that. Three, three hits. hits. And then anything but twos or ones. All right, oh, so fantastic. three fantastic. So that actually, I think that did clean up that whole unit. Uh, that's uh, 13, and I have two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen guys. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Awesome. All right, that makes me happy. All right, Tyranid's bottom of the second. Uh, movement phase. Really nothing spectacular here. I jumped the uh, Shrikes back here. I'm kind of vacillating between which unit I want to uh, attack. I should probably get in on this action because those guys will really put a cramp on my style. Yeah. Uh, these guys are poised to attack. I took this unit, his pr the Primes unit, and just moved it this way because I have a feeling I'm going to need reinforcements over here. And this is, this is really where the, the game is going to be made or broken because this is just cleaning up. Mm -hmm. um, of course, uh, Astaroth is hardly cleaning <laughs> up. Um, <clears throat> and uh, the Shrikes, I've actually kept them kind of back here. And let me tell you. All right, so uh, with a jump... These guys are 18 inches away, so it just it made it slightly more out of their range. Uh, of course, um, yeah, that's that that's that's really a toughie because I want to be close enough to get in there, but far enough away that I don't get charged. So I probably will charge in here. In fact, since I have absolutely no shooting, I'll just start in with my charges. We'll do the strikes first. Oh, four inches. Well, that actually does make it closest to closest here. Rar, rar, and then this guy. And uh, these Ormagants can't help but make it. Uh, but I will get more or less guys in, depending on how good the roll is. A five is plenty. So uh, this whole unit of 20 is raring in on these guys. All right, so uh, that's, that's basically it. All right, so uh, let's go ahead. Let's start here. Um, yeah, initiative five. So pile in. So I do get a few more guys, like, over. All right, I think you get the idea. Well, if you notice, I positioned my guys like that. Okay. So basically, I kind of create a choke point here where you wouldn't get everybody in. That is true. So I'll probably end up with like four guys not in. All right. Okay, so I got 16 guys here, and I'm going to do them in volleys of 16. So we're uh, looking for fours, re-roll ones. Uh, okay, so um, volleys of 16. That is uh, two, four, six, eight, ten hits so far. And let's do the next volley. Reroll ones for scything talons and one cocked. Uh, so um, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 21. Pretty good so far, if you ask me. Slightly above average. 21. And uh, no ones there. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, go uh, 22, 24, 26, 28, 29. So uh, 29 hits, and uh, let's go ahead and um, do uh, 20. This is to wound, so I'm. Uh, oh, wait, hold on. They have Furious Charge. Yeah, so you that get means to. Your strength four. Yeah, you get to re roll failed. I did get to re roll yep. failed wounds. And they have the other thing too. What was it? Po uh, the one that gives them poison, toxin sex. Yeah, toxin. So, looking for fours with re-rolls. Uh, here's cock. Okay. And I have nine after this. So, by the way, this is complete overkill. <laughs> uh, okay. So, um, and then let's uh, roll. So, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, fifteen. Go, go ahead and just start with that. Fifteen. You don't think I can save fifteen? I don't think you can. No. I think mathematically it's so highly unlikely. 10 and 15. Okay, here we go. All right. And will they have uh, feel no pain? Yeah, they do. Okay. Sanguinary Priest, where is he? He's in the other combat. Okay, close enough. 
All right. Oh, no way! Only two failed. Wow, only I might two have failed. to do the other nine. And then... Okay. Well, roll your other nine real fast. Yeah. Nine. yeah, sorry about that. And I'll set off okay, these I'm two right now. I'm just going to do them real right quick now. over here. Oh, no way! Okay, good thing I got the rerolls. Okay. Uh, we've got uh, two, four, six more wounding hits. Six more? Okay, so Kay. two failed saves. So here's my six more saves. Oh, no way. So as long as No I way! I went from this save. is going to be overkill <laughs> to come on. No oh. way. Oh, there's one That's six caught. so far. Oh, no way! I only one killed guy. one guy. <laughs> oh, oh good times, good times. It's zooming in, I don't know. Okay, Rin thinks it's funny. Okay, go ahead, Rin. Do your two guys attack me okay, back. Okay, two guys. I that was, that was pretty pathetic. That's, yeah, that's a lot of guys. All right, um, three hits, and then I need Yeah, threes. 48 attacks. One. One wounding hit. Watch it be a tight combat. Nope, okay. one guy. Oh, yeah, it is a tight oh, yeah, combat. Tight combat. It's amazing. <laughs> wow, that is sad. Oh my god, uh, guy, those four guys not in could have really made a difference. Yeah. Okay, so here we go. All right, and uh, now on to the Shrikes. So uh, initiative step pile in. All right, Shrikes, uh, amazingly, are only initiative four. So if you have a higher initiative person, you should go with them right now. Uh, uh, initiative four? Mm-hmm. So, yeah, he's got a pile in, three inches, probably looks something like this. Lamartus is initiative six. Okay, go for it. Yeah, I think he's the only one that's higher. Lamartes, ah! So he piles in first. Okay, I already moved him three oh, inches from okay. there to there. So, but he does get to attack. Two. <clears throat> and he's not in base contact, right so now. he's not reduced in initiative. What's the strength? Um, he is just strength. Oh, he's got a, a, a power mace now, which means you actually would still go first. Oh, would I? Yeah, because he's initiative one. Oh. But he, he will wound with one. All right, sounds wounds. good. Okay, um, so initiative step piling. So basically these guys are in contact. Their wings prevent them from really moving around. So I end up like this. Okay. So he is initiative one, technically, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so he would still be over here, in case that matters. Uh, by the way, here's the dividing line for this combat. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six death company, including a sanguinary priest, right? Uh, no, he's in the other side. Okay, spot. and then Lamartes. Okay, Shrikes have three attacks, plus one on the charge. <clears throat> so uh, your weapon skill five yes. as well? Okay, so I got fours. Scything Talons allow me to re-roll ones. No conversion on that one. And uh, that was slightly above average. Every hit counts. Two, four, six, seven hits. Uh, wait, that can't be right. Two, four, six, eight hits. There it is. Because I'm like, wait, I had four misses, but 12 attacks. Okay. Um, had a run away there. A five. And um, they are... Um, hold on. These guys have... Nope, they don't have anything special. They're just plain old strength four. Oh, no, wait. Two, four, six wounding hits, no armor saves. Six, okay. Uh, you should probably do them one at a time because you'll be taking one guy, two guy, three guy, four guys off, and then it'll hit Lamartes. Okay. And Lamartes could theoretically be killed by this. All right, um, so let's do this dude first. He's good. Okay, feel no pain. Um, second dude, he's dead. Um, okay, one death. Third guy, he's dead. Okay. Uh, four, this is your, on your fourth, fourth one. Dead. Dead. So one save so far. And then, right, and then this one's on Lamarcus, right? Uh, no, three guys have died. So one, two, three guys died. It's this guy oh, that's that next. Guy okay. okay, fifth he's one, good. he makes it. And then the sixth one. Okay, so he failed his invuln save. Yep. And now, or no, never mind, it was on that guy, so he's dead. Okay. 
Is that All right. right. Yep, that's it. I just keep rolling on them. Uh, no, you've made six saves so far. So these, basically, those four guys are dead. Well, yeah. Uh, I don't think we did that quite right, but I think the result is about right. Okay. So now, now you get to pile in. Yes. And, yeah, okay. and attack. <clears throat> All right. I'm looking pretty good so far, but. Uh, uh, you never know what those death company are going to do. Now, Rin's explaining to me that I was really smart to charge those guys because they get two attacks on the charge. And reroll hits and wounds. All right, awesome. That's a bad thing. All right, so uh, you got one save from Lamartis. Okay, so. just a normal save? Doesn't he have a power uh, weapon or something? Yeah, power weapon. Oh, okay, so I take a wound. Yeah. Okay, and what's then next? One normal guy, one normal guy with a power weapon. Oh, he's got a power weapon. Nice. Right. Okay, so one wound so far. So here's the normal guy. Um, oh, look at that. Three Two hits. sixes and a five is three hits. Six wounds. One. Toughness four. Okay, so one wound. And then the power No weapon. save. Save, yes. Five. Yeah, he save no that. save. So he's taken two wounds. And here's the power weapon. One hit. Oh, awesome. Or no, no hits. No hits? Oh, yeah. that's right. Weapon skill five. Yep. Okay, good. I did right. four wounds. You did two wounds. So are you fearless? Yeah, fearless. Okay. All right. <clears throat> so we end up something like this. All right. Not too shabby. All right, we have one uh, combat left with this one Ormagant. Ormagant strikes. Ormagant strike! we are <laughs> One wound. Take one that. Wound. Good. Ah, with a six. Okay. Sounds good. All right, swing. Blah, blah, blah. Do leverage. I don't know. Yeah, do your can. best weapon first. Three hit. Three sixes. That yeah. librarian is like, I do not like this Ormagant. Yeah, he, he's super dead. Blah. All right, consolidation. One. one inch. All right, folks, that is where the combat is. And I got to tell you, I love Ormagants. <laughs> lots and 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 lots of Ormagants. There's never been a gaunt like Ormagants. But um bum bum bum. <laughs> hey, do you know what that's from? No. Okay. What is it? We'll see we'll see if the fans can get that one. I'll give you a hint, it's a children's program. <laughs>